got mail. Today's Daily Mail Call comes from the Book of Psalms, chapter 37, from verses 9 through 22, entitled, The Wicked and Righteous's Fate. For evildoers shall be cut off, but those that wait upon the Lord, they shall inherit the earth. For yet a little while, the wicked shall not be, yea, thou shalt diligently consider his place, and it shall not be. But the meek shall inherit the earth, and shall delight themselves in the abundance of peace. The wicked plotteth against the just, and gnasheth upon him with his teeth. The Lord shall laugh at him, for he seeth that his day is coming. The wicked have drawn out the sword, and have bent their bow to cast down the poor and needy, and to slay such as be of upright conversation. Their sword shall enter into their own heart, and their bow shall be broken. A little that a righteous man hath is better than the riches of many wicked. For the arm of the wicked shall be broken, but the Lord upholdeth the righteous. The Lord knoweth the days of the upright, and their inheritance shall be forever. They shall not be ashamed in the evil time, and in the days of famine they shall be satisfied. But the wicked shall perish, and the enemies of the Lord shall be as the fat of lambs. They shall consume into smoke, shall they consume away. The wicked borroweth and payeth not again. The righteous sheweth mercy and giveth. For such as be blessed of him shall inherit the earth, and they that be cursed of him shall be cut off. Once again, this daily mail call comes from the book of Psalms, chapter 37, from verses 9 through 22, entitled, The Wicked and the Righteous's Fate.